do I have this thing that I lost the pressure plate where I moved and now I'm going to have to make another one so let's stop by just measuring this thing and we get approximately 5 millimeters. so let's just make the inner part the tube 6 millimeters wide and it should just slide onto this thing Here we have the finished part, but there's a problem. Over extrusion caused it to not come out in the right size. So I had to redo that part. And now we have the part that I needed in the first place. And this one actually fits over the thing. And I've tested this one already and it'll hold itself against the table. I mean, I'm not sure that you can see, but there are some pressure marks and I did squeeze it pretty hard and it still works. So you can indeed make parts that can be instantly used with a 3D printer.